Hello guys, uh, this will be, I don't know what to call it, like a tutorial to do smart physics problem and uh, I want to share it with you and it's for me for studying. But anyway, we have this circuit that has inductor in it and there is resistance, there is a voltage and this is the switch. <laughs> So the first question they're asking is the switch has been open for a long time when at time t equals zero the switch is closed. What is I10, the magnitude of the current through the resistor R1 just after the switch is closed? Okay, so they want the current in resistor 1. We're just going to go conceptually about this, think about this. Okay, so when it's right closed, like at the moment t equals 0, the inductor will induce current that's opposite to what's happening here. So it's going to act like and like there's no wire there. Okay. So if there was no wire, how is gonna how how's the circuit is gonna look like? Yeah, this is what it's gonna look like. And the current through all these resistors is the same. So I one is the I total, which is V over R total. And since it is in series, so V battery, let's call this VB over R1 plus R2 plus R3 plus R4. And you'll get the answer. <coughs> Alright, next question is asking what is I1 at time infinity? Like, so when the switch is closed for a long time. What's going to happen when the switch is closed for a long time? Then the inductor will act like an open wire, at this case. So when it does like an open wire, this is the new circuit. I kind of like that. So there's an open wire. So they want the current and I1, the same thing. Okay, so if this is an open wire, then the current won't go this way because it's going to go to the less resistant, which is this wire. And if you do it in parallel, they're going to end up being zero. Okay, so the current will go through this and this. Okay, so it's going to be V, and this one is R1, this is R4. So I1 equal to R1 plus R4. Okay, nice. Right, so number three. Number three is asking what is VL at time equals zero? The magnitude, the magnitude of the voltage across the inductor just after the switch is closed. Okay, so they want the voltage across the inductor when the switch is closed. Okay, so since there's there is no current going through it then the voltage is zero, but no, that's not how it does it work. It has a voltage. And how can we know that? It has the same voltage as this because it's in parallel or as this too. Okay. So how do we go? figure this out. So let's call this VL at time equals zero will be equal to so where is the voltage in this section? Mm. So it's going to be VB minus I1 R1 minus I1 R4 then we'll get the answer. Well, 
well, which R are we using in this? I mean, which I are we using? So since it is white when we closed it, so this is going to act like this, the inductor will act like there's no wire in there. So it's going to be the the eye that we the eye that we got from series. So, so this is the eye that we're going to use in here. So it's going to be like this: VB minus I1, R1 plus R4. Okay. Or we can do the same by two. R3 because this has the same voltage too as this right I mean as this here so yeah we can do the same as I1 R2 plus R3 even times the I1 and we're using the same I as the as the one in series here Okay, so number four. Number four is asking at what is IL after the switch is closed for a long time? What is the current that's going through the inductor after it's been closed for a very long time? Well, after it was closed for a long time, then it's going to act like a wire like there's no inductor right so we're looking at this one so when it's acting like a wire then the same current that's going through this resistor is going through the other resistor here and then through the battery so the same I is going here 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 because series the current is the same Okay. So what is I here? It's the one we used here. So it's the same as the answer from number two. This is the current. Alright, the question number five. It's asking what is I two right when we close? Right when we close the switch. So they want the current that's going through I through R2 here. Okay, so right when we close the switch, what does the inductor act like? It acts like there's nothing there. It's like this one. So what is the current through this one too? It's like... all of these in series and this is the V, the voltage, the battery so it's the same answer as this one okay so it's the same from answer number number one this one answer number two uh, I hope it helped if it did not I'm sorry if I did confuse you with anything I'm just a student that taking the course with you now so good luck in physics it's really tough and but, but I love it good luck